Welcome in my messy room and that's what 550 euros can buy you in Munich, Germany for a month. And that's not Bali. In Bali you can live like a king for 550 euros or like semi king. But in this episode I'll show you some advanced editing techniques you can achieve with your mobile phone while you're editing videos on your mobile phone. And the first one is inspired by this guy Alex Zorski. Let me show it to you. Oh, come here. First thing first, we have to find an egg. I don't have eggs, so we're gonna steal some from the fridge. This one is not mine, he's my roommate. But I asked him before that. I'm not from those awful people that eat the food of others without asking first. We'll need something soft because the egg is going to drop on the ground and I don't want mess. Mary is going to kill me if I fuck up the bed. Let's find some tripods and put the cameras. I'm going to record a TikTok video, that's why we'll shoot in portrait mode. Now the second challenge is to put the egg in your mouth because it's quite big. Ah. Oh, I broke it. Let's edit that video, the best application for a job, it's video lip. So open it, I already imported the video, the first thing is to duplicate it. Okay, we have that one, we have to move it up. So we click the mixer and we drag it over the other video. Here we have to do several procedures. First, find transform and flip it. Second, apply a mask, linear mask and we have to reverse it. Perfect. And I would like to see a little bit of the t-shirt. Great, now just click on the clip and drag it. Okay, the clips are aligned perfectly now. To achieve the effect, we have to reverse the bottom clip. So find where is written reverse. Here, press reverse. And now we have to align the egg. That's very tricky. So when the egg hits the middle line, it has to hit the middle line in both clips. That's a little bit tricky part. So first find where the egg is hitting the middle line here. Okay, perfect. So we trim the video tube here, find the second point where the egg is hitting the line and drag the other clip in the beginning of the line. For the second example, we're gonna use a green screen. That one is enormous. Or maybe the blue one. We're gonna record a fresco ball. I did a really cool advertising bureau for the guys. You can check it here. I recorded it with my iPhone. Unbelievable. Make the rotation, we're gonna use a fishing line. The magic of the blue or green screen videos is happening on post-production. I'll show you now how you can create high quality, professional advertising video in a messy room. If you have some kind of business and you want to advertise your products, that's an amazing way. For this example, I'm going to use VN application, is free application for Android and iPhone. So you can use it without any restriction. I already imported the video and the first thing is to reverse the video. I want the video to start with the spinning and to finish with the butt not moving. Okay, perfect. The second thing is that I want to slow down the video. So we'll go to speed and I shot it in 60 frames per second so, so I can slow it down two times, so 0.5. Perfect, now it's nice and smooth. To be able to activate the chroma key functionality, you have to move the video one layer up. So here we have to scroll to the right and click the forward button. And now the video is on top. And as you can see, when you mark the video, a new button appeared called chroma. Just click chroma 
drag the cover you would like to remove, just find the cover that matches everything and then play with the slider till we remove everything from the blue. We created a transparent video, we can place whatever we want under that video. I forgot to flip it, so I would like to flip it and to mirror it so the text is visible. Perfect. And then we have to fit it to the screen. Fit. Great. Oh, we miss a little bit of blue here. So let's go back to the chroma and increase a little bit. Perfect. Now we don't have any blue color. Let's go to mask and remove the cord. We have to reverse the mask. Perfect. And the line is mostly not visible. Apply the mask. If what I'm doing doesn't make sense, just hold on to the end result. You're gonna be surprised. Now let's open again the speed because I want the beginning of the video to be very fast. It will be the intro of the video. So here speed, but now we go to curves. If you don't know how to work with the curves for speeding up or speeding down the video, check my video here, it's really helpful. Now let's find the out point, it's here. So pause, okay. I want to speed that point, that point I want to be extremely fast and the beginning, so. I promise it will make sense in a second. Apply it, now we have to animate it. Click the top layer, add a keyframe. When you activate the keyframes, the application will automatically calculate the states between two different states. For example, if here the size is like that and here is big, it will calculate all the middle stages. Let me, sh well, let me directly show you, I'm horrible in, in explaining. So here I want to be very small and to be rotated. Very, very tiny small. And to start somewhere from here. Then I want to go a little bit till the spinning is finishing and then I want to scale it up. Let's play it and see the result. Play. Okay, mostly perfect, we'll have to adjust the keyframes. The second one is too late. So to drag the keyframe left or right, just mark the keyframe, hold your finger above it and now you can drag it. Let's play it. Perfect. Now let's duplicate the layer. Rotate it. Move it somewhere on the other side. And here cross them like a pirate sign. It will look amazing. Um, the video to look more interesting, I want to misalign the keyframes because otherwise it will look symmetrical and it will not look cool. So we just drag the second keyframe and drag it a little bit out. Now let's play it. And now left two things, to add the logo of the company and to add some cool background. Let's start with the background. Rescue Ball is a beach game, so a drone shot from the beach will look awesome. Now we have to align it. We have to go to crop and that's perfect, apply and then we have to blur it. Okay, somehow with VN application you cannot blur the image. So what I did is to reduce the exposure and to zoom out to part of the image which is only sand and uh, water like that, the rockets are popping out. Now let's import the logo and create one more animation. Import it. We want the logo to appear after we spin the rockets, so somewhere here. So let's make them disappear. So from here, rotating, 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 perfect. And then we pop the logo here. To make it smooth, we have to play with the opacity and we have to animate it. So click on the opacity, add a keyframe for the opacity, 100%, go to the end of the video and reduce the opacity and automatically we want another keyframe. And we have to do exactly the same for the second video. Mark the video, Create a keyframe, opacity 100%, at the end of the video, reduce the opacity to zero. Come on. And now let's animate the logo. 
let's make it pop. So create a keyframe, opacity 0 and we want to zoom it out. Move, move a little bit to the right, push the opacity to 100% and scale up the logo. Now let's check what did we create. We can also overlap them a little bit. Okay, perfect. Not too bad for animation done on the iPhone. We can make it bounce a little bit. So next to our keyframe, let's create one more keyframe. Scale it up, move back, scale down, and let's bounce back to our desired size. Let's check how does it look. Perfect. Cool, I don't like just the background, it's too pale. Can it be something brighter? In general, we can make it, we can reset it. It's pretty amazing that we managed to create something like that with our mobile phone, but when you know what you're doing, the result is amazing. So it's not so important your equipment, it's more important how you use the equipment. If you want to learn more in a short period of time, go out and check my mobile cinematic course in the description, there the information is very condensed. Now don't forget to smile, hit the like button, hit the subscribe button and go and watch some more videos, they're really cool.